Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Two Shot here from Two Shot Gaming, and in today's quick little video, we're gonna um go over how you install texture packs. A lot of guys are asking this. I don't know if you found out by now. This is like the last two days. Um, I'm not really sure, but what I read on the way that one point one point six point one or whatever is coming out, it kind of was like a little self-explanatory. Um. I'm not sure how good they are if they handle HD, so I got a 16-bit one and a 64-bit one, just for testing reasons. Well, let's see what let's see what happens. Percent app data percent. Going to our roaming, right? Go down to your start, obviously, right? Go to your start, type in percent app data percent, and then click on your roaming. So I've been doing a lot of videos. I'm getting kind of like crazy about it. <laughs> then go to your dot Minecraft. Right now, you have everything in here. You got resource packs. Now these are supposed to hold. We got the uh, the A R A R S A resource pack. This was I'm pretty sure was a 16 bit texture pack. I, I never checked none of these out. And we got elementals R P R P R P G. This is a texture pack, and it also has a music thing we can put inside. I don't know. We're going to find out if it works, right? But that's supposed to be the big thing about these resource packs. I think they can change the music in the game. If I'm not mistaken. And if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. <laughs> you know, we'll find out, though. But that's what I think, or to make the makes everything have different sounds and stuff like that. So it should be pretty cool. So let's, um, let's go into our shot pack, right? As we made in the last episode. And just log in. And I don't know, like, I, I'm thinking the other one was a 16-bit pack, so that should work with no problem. The other one, I think, was 64. So, let's see, options, resource packs. All right, so the only resource pack is showing is in here. You can go here to look at it, too. See, the 64-bit one's not showing. And I'm thinking that's probably why, because it's an HD texture pack, so it's not going to show. Which is pretty cool, because then you're not loading in ones that don't work. So this one should work. Yeah, see, you see how the the GUI and everything changed? So we're going to have the the GUI, you know, whatever you want to call it. It looks kind of cool. I have no clue what it looks like, so we're, we're just here. We're here together. So if you want to put in anything 16-bit, you can get away with that and put those in here. Oh, yeah, Biosphere World. It's actually kind of cool texture pack, right? I found these on Planet Minecraft. I just went there quick and downloaded some. Just to give you like a little idea, you can kind of look through it a little bit. See what you like. Not bad. It's pretty good for a 16-bit one. I think he's still working on some of them. Because he's missing some of you know, water bottles and stuff like that. But, no, no, actually, I think these, those are different. But, he, well, you know, everything just came out, so. But I kind of like what he did with some of them. I like the, t like, you know, for... A non HD pack, not bad at all, right? And this is all this regular music, so nothing special in this one. We can't test that part out, so we could lower it down now. So that's how you install those. If you want HD ones, I'm probably gonna have to look it up. We're probably gonna have to go through like MC Patcher, or when Optifine comes out, they're gonna have a resource folder where you can just pop them in there. It's going to be like pretty much the same basis, but the resource, you know, resource pack folder. Like the same way you just did that, where you just put your HD ones in there for Optifine. Oh, look at all the kitties. Alright guys, so thanks so much for watching, until next time, peace!